what is up youtube welcome back again it's a buddy techno boy and uh, uh, today i'm back with another class d amplifier well you have seen this kind of amplifier before well that was a four channel amplifier i made them two channel and then added another mini amp with, for another two channels so that was four channel class d amplifier pure four channel not the same uh, what to say four speakers connected to two channels like that. It's not like that But this one is like a 4.1 amplifier as you have seen I have modified uh, all this That's the main volume that's volume for uh, Two channels and that's the volume for another two channels So that's the amp and this is the black wire you can see that's going out to a power subwoofer which is right there behind this table and that's a control part of that so uh, that's the subwoofer is connected uh, here to the volume control so i can control uh, everything all the 4.1 speakers using this volume control so first of all i'm going to do uh, adjust this uh, two volumes for the four channels and then going to adjust uh, this volume for the subwoofer and then I can control all of them using this volume increase it decrease it whatever I want so uh, let me tell you I'll put the link in the uh, I button right here the previous make the four channel amplifier so you can go there and check them out the connections and all so in this case here I'm telling you that's the main volume control so that's the input and from input uh, three connections are coming to this volume control uh, to the left terminals and then from the middle terminals that's the output from the volume control going to this volume and also parallelly connected to this volume so these two volume controls inputs are coming from this volume controls output so I increase and dec decrease this one that will work with both of them so now from here this volume control the output is going to uh, that kit in that kit's input and from this volume controls the output is going to this kit this one's input so that's a 3110 IC class D amplifier with 15 watt per channel 15 plus 15 30 watt and that's a PAM 8403 IC amplifier with a 3 plus 3 watt Per channel and for this kit small kit I'm having uh, this speaker mini bookshelf speakers with a three inch of a driver and uh, they are producing very loud and good sound and for that 30 watt kit I'm using this tower speakers with four inch woofer and a three inch woofer and one inch dome tweeter and same uh, right channel here so that's for you can say that's for front channels and that case for uh, rear channels like that and uh, now let me turn this on play the song and this let me increase this volume a bit and then i increase this one So this volume are for these two channel speakers and this volume control is for the bottom speakers, the tower speakers. So so now uh, that thing is adjusted and now I adjust this one so now both the channels are working you see I 
<coughs> well now as you can see that all four channels are working now I can control all the four channels by using this volume control on and now let's turn the volume for the subwoofer up and now uh, let's check it out the, the, this one is up but still there is no bass you cannot hear any bass now when I increase this volume then you can hear the bass and the channel sounds too So all I gotta do is I just need to set this two and that one, this three volume control, adjust them, the sound, the bass and uh, all the channels and then I can simply control everything by using this volume control only. And let me show you the sub uh, right behind the table. So that's my 4.1 simple class D amplifier which is working pretty good and in a previous video I showed you how you can connect a any power what to say unused subwoofer to a stereo one so if you didn't see that video you can check the i button and also you can go to my playlist and uh, video list and you can uh, find so many videos on amplifiers and uh, all the stuff like that so that's it that's all for today if you have any question regarding this kind of amplifier and if you want some advice or idea for making any this kind of amplifier or if you have any new idea to make amplifier you can uh, simply state me in the comments below you can ask me whatever you want I'll try to re reply to all of you guys so that's all for today so in the next video thanks for watching bye bye